Welcome back to Wide World of Sports. We're in Western Sydney at the Speedway by the Freeway. It's loud, it's dirty, and it's a sport that's survived in this country since the 1920s. Some write it off as a novelty from another era, but to its fanatical fans, it'll never die. What do you love about Speedway, mate? Mate, the racing, the fumes, the smell, and dirt in the eyes. What about yourself? <laughs> oh, mate, I love all of that. Um, I've been going here since I was two weeks old, and it's pretty much my life, and it's just so fun to come. It's fast, it's exciting, um, it's a great night out. Some people reckon this sport was almost going to die. What do you say to them? Uh, I wouldn't like to say it on TV, but yeah, no, Speedway won't die, mate. It's, it's action plus. If you've never been, get out of here. Oh yeah, I think every sport has its ups and downs. This has a lot, but by oh, Jesus, it's still going to keep going. It won't die. It won't die. I'll die before that. <laughs> Where's the sport out on a hole? The sport holds a niche in motorsport, uh, and as long as the promoters realise where it sits, we are, we're very safe. We kind of know what Speedway is, but who is Speedway? Speedway is uh, family. Have a look around on the hill there, and it's family, mum, dad, three kids, uh, on a Saturday night enjoying themselves. This is a sport with a rich history. Jack Brabham was a state Speedway champ 10 years before his first Formula One crown. From the Second World War to the late 70s, it was standing room only at the old Sydney showground every Saturday night. Drivers like Gary Rush and Bob Two Gun Tattersall were names you knew. But in 96, the government closed Speedway's mecca to make way for Fox Studios. It's taken the sport more than a decade to recover. Um, it was a sad time for the sport, but uh, we've, we've survived it. Uh, the sport went backwards, it's now come forward, and uh, we're here to stay. Here to stay indeed, Speedway. Great sport, great night out. If you get a chance to do it, you should take the family along. Get those fumes, get the dirt in the nose and the face. Nothing better. Uh, now, to commemorate the All Blacks 